आर टी सी वॉट इज दैट वाई वी आर यूजिंग सेल इट्स अ थ्री ओर्ड सेल कंटेन सप्लाई टू आर टी सी सेक्शन थर्टी टू पॉइंट सेवन सिक्स एट क्रिस्टल वॉट इज द यूज ऑफ दिस क्रिस्टल इयर सो टूडेज क्लास आर टी सी सेक्शन इन पी सी एच रिस्ट वॉच डिजिटल क्लॉक टू नो हाउ इट विल वर्क मिनिट्स सेकेंड्स आवर्स कीप ऑन मूविंग हाउ द आंसर इज क्रिस्टल हॉसिलेटर बट वंस यू रिमूव द सेल अगेन यू नीड टू सेट द डेट एंड टाइम राइट द सेम प्रोसीजर इन क्रिस्टल आर टी सी सेक्शन ऑल्सो ओके लेट एस स्टार्ट पी सी एच आर टी सी सेक्शन टी सी स्टैंड फॉर रियल टाइम क्लॉक दीज आर द पी सी एच सिग्नल इंटरफेस ब्लॉक्स ओके दिस आर द सिग्नल ब्लॉक्स ऑफ द पी सी एच सी इंटेल फ्लेक्सीबल डिस्प्ले इंटरफेस पी सी इंटरफेस कंट्रोल लिंक इन दिस ईयर इफ यू कम डाउन इफ यू कम डाउन ईयर इज द आर टी सी सेक्शन दिस इज वन ऑफ द ब्लॉक सी इन दिस आर टी सी सेक्शन द क्रिस्टल इनपुट आउटपुट यूल गेट ओके बिलो दिस यू गेट सोम इंफॉर्मेशन रिगार्डिंग दिस मिसलिनियस सिग्नल्स दिस बिलोंग्स टू आर टी सी वन ऑफ दिस इज नॉट बिलोंग्स टू दिस बट एनी वे सो वॉट इज आर टी सी एंड वॉट आर द आर टी सी सेक्शंस वट वॉट आर द कॉम्पोनेंट इट कंटेंट्स एवरी थिंग इन डिटेल्स वी विल चेक हियर इज द लिथियम सेल इट्स अ टू जीरो थ्री टू आर सो नेम ऑल्सो विल वेरी इट गिवस कंटिन्यूस थ्री वोल्स पॉवर सप्लाई दट बैटरी वोल्टेज एंटर्स टू टू ट्वेंटी के होम्स रजिस्टर थ्रू द शॉर्ट की डायोड्स आफ्टर द टू आर सी सर्क्यूट्स टू डिफरेंट नेम हैज मैंशनड वन इज आर टी सी आर एस टी एश एंड अदर नेम इज एस आर टी सी आर एस टी एश यर ये टू लेग थर्टी टू पॉइंट सेवन सिक्स एट किलो एड्स क्रिस्टल ऑल्सो हैज यूज द टू लेग नेम्स आर आर टी सी एक्स वन एंड द फीडबैक लेग नेम इज आर टी सी एक्स टू सो now this is called external circuit of the rtc section and now we will check what is that rtc section what is this external section the circuit what it does what it names for what reason the rtc section has used this particular circuit one by one i will explain rtc in pch See the PCH contains a Motorola MC one four six eight one eight B compatible real time clock with two fifty six bytes of battery backed RAM. See it contains a Motorola IC with the battery backed RAM. Okay, it has two fifty six bytes. The real time clock performs two key functions: keeping track of the time of day, and second one is storing system data. even when the system is powered down the rtc operates on a 32.768 kilo ads crystal and a 3 volts battery see the 3 volts battery is very very important this required to operate this particular motorola ic using this crystal okay without this it won't work 3 volts is mandatory okay now the rtc also supports two lockable memory ranges by setting bit in the configuration space two 8 byte ranges can be locked to read and write access this prevents unauthorized reading of passwords or other system security information you know right it stores password and more security systems in bias what are the changes you will do those things it will change in bias you have the password protect protection also right that one also this particular rtc section will save the rtc is also supported a date alarm uh, that allows for scheduling a wake up event up to 30 days in advance rather than just 24 hours in advance here is the motorola ic mc14681 this one is a actually there which i mentioned it's a b okay both are similar Here is the CMOS, CMOS silicon gate complementary MOS, 
complementary okay silicon gate complementary mos real time clock plus ram okay so what it contains see it looks like this pin configuration it will be like this what it has see low power high speed cmos internal time base and oscillator counts seconds minutes and hours of the day counts days of the week date month and years it operates 3 volts to 6 volts the maximum supply is 6 volts time based input options see it has 4.194304 megahertz 1.048576 megahertz or 32.768 kilohertz crystal okay it will support all three but as per the pch it will support this one hmm, it has taken as per the schematic so time based oscillator for parallel resonate crystals hmm, so many things are there you can read carefully slowly you can read microprocessor bus compatible hmm, multiple options are there 24 pin dual inline package quad pack also available here is the black diagram that oscillator 1 and 2 will give right VDD is the supply ground is the supply this is the black diagram of this particular re real time clock I see 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 the crystal oscillator connection how we have to give this oscillator 1 here and oscillator 2 here actually this is the feedback oscillator if uh, internally the crystal how it looks like see l1 c1 rs the same crystal okay pin number 3 and pin number 2 here is a capacitor see the diode 1 and diode 2 diode 2 from the battery side and diode 1 for the system side both 3 volts supply that LDO supply goes to internal Motorola IC MC146818 it will be inside the PCH guys in many videos in many institutes you have learned what is the RTC and what is the RTC section see in anywhere you go just as per the schematic what it does and by their experience what it will do those things only you come to know but the real fact of this RTC RST ash today you come to know definitely I'm telling because this is as per the Intel I am telling, I am talking about as per the intel, I am not assuming anything but what this particular signal will do. Let us check, see, clearing battery backed RTC RAM, that battery backed IC will be there, no, that Motorola, it will store some memory, correct, that one, how we can reset it, clearing CMOS RAM in PCH based platform can be done by using a jumper on RTC RST hash. See the motor law, what it does is store the memory, right? It store the uh, password related uh, things and the date and time related things and the wake up huh, the events it will store, right? Those things, if we want to reset it, then this particular path in RTC section we have to use the name has given as RTC reset hash RTC RST hash it may be jumper okay or GPI implementations should not attempt to clear CMOS by using a jumper to pull VCC RTC low okay using RTC RST hash to clear CMOS CMOS complementary MOS metal oxide semiconductors advice a jumper on rtc rst ash can be used to clear cmos values what are the values it stored what are the manually uh, what is that users has given no those information it will delete and it will set for as a default see as well as reset to default value the state of those configuration bits that resides in the rtc power well see it will reset to previous values 
when the rtc rst is strapped to ground when you connect to the ground the rtc power sts bit d31 uh, colon f0 colon a4h bit 2 will be set and those configuration bits in the rtc power well will be set to their default state bias can monitor the state of this bit see first bias will consider what it can consider it will consider this motorola chip and manually clear the rtc cmos array once the system is booted the normal position would cause rtc rst ash to be pulled up through a weak pull up register hmm? the particular table shows which bits are set to their default state when rtc rst is asserted this rtc rst ash jumper technique allows the jumper to be moved and then replaced all while the system is powered off that jumper you know in desktop we are using the jumper this is talking about that jumper then once booted the rtc power rts can be detected in the set state okay see in pch configuration hmm, configuration bits reset by rtc rst ash see bit name alert what is the alarm alarm interrupt enable alarm flag hmm, this are the location bit default state see slps4 minimum assertion width slps4 rtc power status that stc which uh, we saw now this is the path location and after g3 enable power button override status rtc event enable and sleep type pme enable bat low enable ri enable this is very very important in power section of rtc sorry that pch intruder detect hmm, door has closed or not tap swap ts see these all are the process it will do rtc rst default value it will do here rtc rst ash and srtc rst ash what it does rtc rst ash is used to reset pcs registers in the rtc well to their default value just now i showed you know what are the values if a jumper is used on this pin it should only be pulled low when system is in the g3 state see it won't power on okay g3 state and then replace it to the default jumper position in desktop you are doing right this jumper values so upon booting bias should recognize that rtc rst ash was asserted and clear internal pch register uh, re registers accordingly it is imperative that this signal not be pulled low in the s0 to s5 states SRTC RST ash is used to reset portion of the Intel C this is very very important why SRTC RST has used you never seen in any videos or any coaching centers i think so but maybe or may not be okay see the most important information is about this SRTC RST is used to reset portion of the Intel management engine and should not be connected to the to a jumper or button on on the platform the only time this signal gets asserted driven low in com uh, combination with rtc srtc ash should be when the coin cell battery is removed or not installed and the platform is in the g3 state pulling this signal low independently without rtc rst ash also being driven and driven low may cause the platform to enter an intermediate state similar to rtc rst ash it is imperative that srtc rst ash not be pulled low in the s0 to s5 state now you got it right srtc rst ash this is rtc x1 and rtc x2 this is a crystal input and outputs okay crystal input 1 this signal is connected to the 32.768 kilohertz crystal 
okay this one also this signal is connected to the crystal 32.768 kilohertz regarding this i already previously released a video regarding the rtc so if you search the rtc section in my channel then you come to know what are the rtc x1 signal and rtc x2 signal in dso clear cut i explained all the signal things okay you can check there okay that's it that rtc rx rtc srtc rst ash rtc rst ash rtc x1 rtc x2 now you come to know why the backup 3 volts are used the continuous power supply why we are using in rtc section okay if you have any doubts please put it in comment i will try to explain okay and if you want to know more anything about this rtc section please explain in comment those things i will try to release a video regarding that okay so that's it it's actually not that's it it will be more if i tell you will become it will become bored okay that's why i'm not uh, going forward so i'm winding up in this sections that's it thank you thank you very much